missed the last 15, hadn't played since March the 12th. He's on the ice to start the game today, and we're underway. Greenway able to play it through to Felino and across to Erickson Eck. Erickson Eck throws it toward the net, wrapped it with an awkward save. Loose puck, a back hitter by Felino, and a save by Ranta. Beats him right in front of the net, but you see the three big boys from Minnesota going to the net, and that's one of their strengths, and they do it very well, and they did it real well here. Unfortunately, Ranta made the save. Off the boards and out to center ice. Dumba back defensively for the Wild. Kessel throws it back across for a shot. That's kicked away by Talbot. On that line together in the fourth line. So a big change for Arizona there. Dvorak turned it over. Benino couldn't find the handle cleanly. Now he got it to Parisi back of the net. Out to the line. Spurred to the drive. Saved by Ranta. You see holds for Minnesota. And now it deflects to center. Pitlick got it ahead to Kraus. Kraus moving in a shot. Saved by Talbot. After he had been scratched in three of the previous five. Kessel a shot. Gloved and dropped by Talbot. He hands it off to Suter. Easy to see it, even though we haven't been in and around the locker room this year because of the COVID restrictions. You can feel it from this team that this is a tight bunch. Loose puck controlled by Minnesota. The pass at center deflected by Zuccarello. Anti Ranta gave it away. Kaprizov a shot right on and a save by Ranta. Hartman brings it all the way around. Keller pressuring Susi. It comes loose to Fiala. Shot right on and a save by Ranta top like that they seem to stack four guys right deep little give and go gets Johansson and Zuccarello scores what a play what a great play and a great pass by Johansson and Zuccarello got it on the inside before the goaltender ran that's all in getting rid of the puck quickly watch how fast Zuccarello shoots this puck right there on a stick and before the goalie can react on the short side. Great passing play. Great passing play between Hartman and Johansson to gain the zone cleanly on the rush. And that's what's so important, getting into the zone with possession rather than having to dump the puck in and go chase it. When you get... He Eck and uh, Greenway. He starts with Erickson Eck here with Minnesota on the penalty kill. This is one of the areas where Felino has been so valuable to Minnesota this year, his ability to kill penalties. Will allow Minnesota a chance. Suter has Erickson Eck ahead of the play. Erickson Eck with Suter driving the net. Suter denied by Ranta. Move the puck quicker. You don't take as much time to make plays as you would otherwise. Minute six left in the Coyote man advantage. Dalagoski. And now Chikrin moving in. He scores. Beat Talbot to the glove side, and the power play goal for Arizona ties the game 1-1. It's a great over in that corner. What a season this young kid is having. His father, Jeff, he was more of a defensive player than this. This guy has really got offensive skills. He can shoot it. Chickering who lack. They, they're more effective down low around the net, you know, with passes across or low shots. But I have to tell you, I've never seen so many goals scored on the short side. Bonino shot, kicked out, Parisi scores! Great, great rebound given to Parisi there after Felino takes that shot and he just puts it on the side before Rantana could uh, get back in there. Take advantage of rebounds and Parisi always goes to the net. He makes the pass across, you see him on the right side of the screen, that rebound comes right out to him and he's got just a yawning net. Makes no mistake about it. Benino with a great shot right there. The rebound coming to a wide open net for Parisi. And by the way, Sturm going to the net. He doesn't make contact. Now Greenway supports the play. Benino out front. Greenway on the backhand. Saved by Ranta. Rebound loose. And he's able to cover with Eric Sinek hammering away. Kessel leads a two on one. He has Kraus with him. Kessel moving in a shot saved by Talbot and the rebound knocked away picked up by Ian Cole way a scoring chance there now Hunt moves in Hunt centered broken up by Susie Kessel tries to tuck one in from behind the net and Talbot kicked that away 45 in the power play Spurgeon a shot that was blocked rebound could not be cleared Fiala holds into the corner it's Kaprizov Tried to force it up front, but he no scores! <laughs>
Well, Kaprizov comes around and then he's going to make the pass out. It gets deflected right to Bonino and Bonino puts it away. In possession in his own, the puck comes down deep to Kaprizov coming around on net. You look, he wants to pass it out. It goes off the defenseman, right over to Bonino, and he puts it away. Watch as he's getting checked here by Ekman. We get set for the third period in St. Paul. Wild win the draw, and Suter plays it ahead. Fiala plays ahead to Hartman as the Wild change. And it was an awkward change, so... Hartman basically had to give the puck away. Yeah, they had to watch for too many men on the ice. Here comes Johansson in for Minnesota. Drops to Zuccarello. He scores! <laughs> Second power play goal for Zuccarello today. It's 4-1 Minnesota. A pass here for Hartman. The drop pass coming right here. It's actually looking how fast he got that away. It actually, was Johansson drops that pass. Watch right, right through the defenseman. And that's why through the legs off the defenseman. Well, no, capitalizing on the loose play by Arizona back in their own zone. Bonino at center. Settles the bouncing puck. Goes across to Parisi. Centers. They score! Spurgeon on the tip. And Minnesota makes it 5-1. All the way up. Look at this. You see them coming down the ice. Parisi's going to be in the left, and here comes Spurgeon right down the middle. Parisi's looking for him, waits till the perfect moment, gets that pass across right on the tape, and Spurgeon just deflects it, just changes the direction. Don't shoot it right up and over the corner. What an excellent play. Hunt on the attack for the Coyotes. Sprawls and throws one off the side of the net. Johan Larson trying to spin away from Johansson. A centering pass, and Kessel scores. Well, that's the guy you never want to leave alone in front. A great play out of the corner. Dangerous. And he's had the most ice time for Arizona tonight. He's been the most dangerous player. And right here, makes no mistake about it. You can't leave that guy alone for a second. As the pass goes right across in the far side. And I'll tell you. Colino's back in a second. He's on the ice now. The Wilder back at full strength. A centering pass. And Talbot has to slam the door on Schmaltz. Schmaltz in behind and Talbot with another save. So strong on the puck. Kaprizov centered, deflected out front by Zuccarello, controlled by Chikrin. Dumba with it. Dumba plays it to Kaprizov. Out to Zuccarello for a shot. Saved by Ranta. Fiala tried to get it to Spurgeon. It was deflected away and that will bring us to the final horn. A thorough victory for the Wild here in St. Paul.